Now the last topic of our discussion in case of amplitude modulation is the super heterodyne receivers. This is again a very important topic that you that you should understand properly. Now here in case of super heterodyne receivers or I can say wherein you are going to receive a signal as you know that here would be one antenna. This antenna is going to receive the signal that that are modulated signals and then it is uh, then for for the rest of the part the system is going to demodulate this particular signal at the receiver end now this is the rest of the part that i am talking about here so this is the super heterodyne receiver now here you can see that you have an antenna and this antenna is receiving the signals and the signals are now modulated signals now here in this case you can see different blocks in the receiver now the first block is the rf amplifier the signal that you have received from the antenna is at the frequency known as the carrier frequency as you know that you are getting a modulated signal at the antenna at the receiving antenna so here the modulated signals frequency would be equal to the carrier frequency so here the frequency is carrier frequency now this particular signal is amplified by using an R rf amplifier at the first stage this is the first stage after you have received a signal at the first stage you have to first amplify the signal that you have received so here this rf amplifier is being used to amplify the signal now in the second stage we have a mixer or detector one now here in this mixer mixer this is most important thing that you should learn in case of super heterodyne receivers here in this mixer a mixing is being done or you can say heterodyning heterodyning or mixing is being done in this mixer heterodyning or mixing between the carrier frequency the frequency that is coming from this side and the local oscillator frequency all right in this mixer two signals would be added up or two signals would be mixed together one would be the signal which is coming from rf amplifier so i can denote it as a its frequency is equals to fr and the other signal is equal to the local os signal after the local oscillator so this particular frequency is uh, fl that is the local oscillator frequency now these two signals would be heterodyned or they are mixed together in this mixer so this is the reason this particular uh, receiver is known as heterodyne receiver and why super heterodyne receiver because the frequency of this local oscillator is more than this rf uh, 